your uh, your view of um, Kendrick Nunn and his development. When, when did you first meet Kendrick Nunn? Well, you know, I knew his dad when he was a little fella. I've been knowing him for a while. Uh, as far as his development, you know, I, I watched him throughout high school at Simeon. And I think he's come a long way. He's still some things need to be worked on. He has a pretty jump shot. I would like to see him get to the basket a little bit more. Play with, play with a little bit more confidence, you know. Sometimes he looked like he's he's a little bit shaken, don't know what to do at times. Just play basketball, let the game come to you. But I, I think his development has is, is, is come a long way. Were you watching him last year? Yeah, I watched him last year. You know, uh, I've seen the growth, uh, and, and it's shown here. But I wanted the, that consistency, to that jump shot, that confidence. Yeah, when you play with confidence, you know, the game is much easier. Sometimes I, th I think he doesn't play with confidence. You know, if he misses a shot, he, you know, guys have a tendency to, to, to hang their head. Just play it. Yeah. How about his defensive footwork? And uh, that, uh, how about it? He's an excellent defender. Um, he reminds me of a kid that uh, from Chicago that played for the Magic and a few other teams, DeAndre Liggins, when it comes to defense. I think uh, – uh, he's 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 a good defender, and you can make your living as a defender too. But he also has offensive skills. If he can put both of those together, he could be a, a pretty good ball player. Last question: We want some dirt about Melvin Nunn. Some stories that he doesn't want to have. Oh, well, you know, you have to ask him about his nickname, Slope. He said that I texted him, and he said, "That's so old school. I might have to charge you to use that." <laughs> But no, uh, he's a good guy. He's um, yeah, always a funny kid on the team. Um, just a lot of, just had a lot of fun being around him. He's a great teammate, great friend. You know, what's more special about it? You know, some 20 years later, we still keep in touch. Good. That's the thing about it. You see Ben Wilson's number on his son's back. How does that make it feel? Uh, you know, it just it just shows that. Uh, Ben Wilson is gone, but he's not forgotten. And I, I think not only the players at Simeon, but Chicago players in general, we're, uh, we're going to carry his legacy on. It will never be forgotten.